I think I met a burglar. I think I met someone who actually tried to break into my apartment. And basically, we're, they're like um, renovating outside where I live right now. Basically, things that they like one of these things that the builders put outside your your building that they can kind of go up on to like you know renovate the outside. You know, like one of those uh, one of those things. There's one, and I'm I'm on the like fifth floor or something, you know. And I'm, like I'm really high up. And uh, big stelling, exactly. Scaffolding, exactly. There's a scaffold. So there's one of those uh, scaffolds outside my my building right now. It was like eight o'clock. I'm standing in my kitchen on the fifth floor, and I'm standing there with my friend. Obviously, my window is open because you know it's minus degrees outside, and we were totally not gonna smoke because you're not allowed to smoke in the premise. So we weren't gonna do that. We were just standing there, you know, with an open window, talking. Then, all of a sudden, when we're standing there talking. I hear like, like footsteps, like And there's a fucking guy It was like a Swedish guy With like a bit of a beard He walks up the stairs And like because it's dark In my kitchen Because I haven't installed a lamp yet He doesn't know we're there And he like has a flashlight in his, in his hand And he flashes like us And I'm like What's up, you know? And he gets like super shocked. And this guy, he has a backpack as well. Like a stacked backpack, a flashlight in his hand, uh, a fucking like, uh, like a cap on his head, and like something that, that was blinking in his pocket. Like a, I don't know what it was, like maybe a, a cell phone. It was like, it was lighting up. Something that, something that was glowing in his pocket. And this guy's like, uh, as soon as he sees us, and I'm like, what's up? He's like, uh, do you, do you live here? I was like, yes. What the fuck are you doing here, you know? He's like, uh, and he, he, he just started talking incoherently, making no sense at all. He goes, uh, uh, I'm getting chased by a couple of guys downstairs. I don't know what to do. I'm super scared for my life. Like, what's going on, you know? I was like, where? There's no one down there. He's like, yeah, I don't know. They were chasing me and I ran in here and like, and it makes no sense. And I was like, what? He's like, yeah, I like climbing the roof of buildings. So like he was like saying things that were like contradicting each other, you know? And my friend was also talking to him. Like my friend is also like a big jacked guy. You know, we're both like, you know, 6'4". <laughs> so it's not like he can do anything. We can just push him and he's going to fall down, you know? But I'm like, what the fuck is going on, you know? And uh, I was like, why do you have a flashlight with you? He's like... Yeah, I don't know. Those guys were chasing me. I was like, if they were chasing you, why do you come with a backpack and a flashlight? And it makes no sense. Nothing he says is making any sense whatsoever. He's mumbling. He's like rambling on, you know? And this guy, he... Um, I tell him, look, man, I'm not going to call the police on you. But if anyone sees you up here, they are going to. So get the fuck down. Uh, and he's like, okay, okay. And I was like, okay, good. And then I close the window and then I like fake cast. I walk away, you know? And then like after a minute I walk back and I see him he's still on this fucking scaffold thing but he's like one floor under and he's like still like flashing his light on like the windows there I was like yo are you not going down he's like I'm on my way and then like while he's standing there he's talking really loudly to himself he's talking to himself I'm like what the fuck you know what the fuck is going on this guy is clearly like blasted out of his head this guy's like on fucking heroin or something, you know? He'll be on coke or something. And he goes down and then he jumps on a bike and just like scoots off. And that was it. I didn't see him after that. And I, I've left my apartment with that window open. I was like, what the fuck? The story makes no sense. Nothing made sense. I told you. It was the weirdest fucking Saturday, dude. He could have been a parkour kid. He could have been. He could have been.